بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم سعید ایم ڈی کیڈم سیکیور ڈسکشن میں کیمیکل ایکولیبریم کا ٹاپک ہم آج اس کا کریں گے اس میں اپلیکیشن آف ایکولیبریم کانسنٹ ہے پہلا کوشن ہے کیلکولیٹ دو ویلی آف کیسی فور امونیا سینتیسز ون ایکولیبریم کانسنٹریشن آف نائٹروجن ہائیڈروجن امونیا آر ٹو مولر ٹو مولر این فور مولر ایٹ فور ہنڈر ڈگری سنٹی گریٹ When we write the uh, balanced chemical equation for ammonia synthesis or uski when some case expression like that, then we have to put values in it. So, is me ammonia ki jo concentration hai, uh, 4 molar hai. So, it is 4 square. Nitrogen is 2 or hydrogen is 2 cube hai. So, when we calculate it for to, uh, 16 upon 16 or it comes to be 1. So, correct answer is alpha. Yes, is ka correct answer a gaya hai. اگلا question ہے following our exothermic reaction nitrogen plus ammonia یہ exothermic reaction ہے negative 92.46 kilo joule per mole اس کی energy release ہوتی ہے which is correct statement rate of reaction will increase by increasing temperature بلکل temperature بڑھانے سے جو rate of reaction ہے وہ ہمیشہ بڑھتا ہے ایک الگ چیز ہے that is equilibrium وہ ایک different چیز ہے لیکن temperature بڑھانے سے ہر بار rate of reaction increase ہوتا ہے During contact process of H2SO4 synthesis of following, ye is ki enthalpy hai, it is an exothermic reaction. Which step is used to increase the yield of SO3? Temperature is raised to very high, absolutely not. Because exothermic reaction hai, to temperature kam karna padega. So temperature badhane se reaction will move in backward direction, yield kam ho jayegi. SO3 formed is not removed, ye bhi galat hai. SO3 is formed that is continuously removed. تاکہ پروڈکٹ کم ہوگا اور ریاکشن ویل موو ان دی فورورڈ ڈائریکشن بوٹ ٹمپریچر اور پریشر آر کیپٹ ویری لو ٹمپریچر کو جب آپ کم کریں گے تو ٹھیک ہے ریاکشن فورورڈ جائے گا لیکن پریشر کو کم کرنے سے یا نہ وہ ریاکشن بیک پر جائے گا ایکسیس ایر ایز یوز ایر کے اندر جو ہے وہ آکسیجن گیس ہوتی ہے تو آکسیجن جب بڑھائیں گے جب آپ ریاکشن بڑھائیں گے تو ریاکشن ویل موو ان دی In the Haber process for manufacturing of ammonia, nitrogen is taken from air. This nitrogen we take from air and from the distillation, we separate the nitrogen from air. Because in the air, there is a lot of nitrogen in the air. Which of the following will not change the concentration of ammonia in equilibrium? So, equilibrium catalyst does not affect the equilibrium constant. Equilibrium, sorry. Uh, it only helps us to achieve equilibrium earlier. So, catalyst ke addition se koi fark nahi padega. Which of the following is correct chemical reaction for ammonia formation of the Haber's process? Kaun sa wala hai? So, this one is the correct nitrogen gaseous state mein, hydrogen gaseous state mein, ammonia gaseous state mein. Reversible reaction hai, balanced chemical equation hai. So, alpha is the correct answer. Which of the following will not change in the concentration of ammonia at equilibrium? Addition of catalyst does not change. Upper question ho chuka hai. For higher yield of ammonia, increase in temperature is replaced by increasing the pressure, decreasing the volume. Or Charlie is the correct, uh, sorry, uh, higher yield. All of these hum ye karte hain. Ki jab aap uh, temperature ko badhayenge, to usse yield kam hogi. To iske liye humne pressure ko badha diya, volume ko kam kar diya. Or catalyst use kar diya. Catalyst... کا خیر اس کی اولیبریم کی اوپر کوئی اثر تو نہیں ہوتا but it helps us to achieve equilibrium earlier یہ اس میں ڈلٹا is the correct answer an equilibrium is represented by the following equation یہ اس کے لیے ہے اور یہ میں نے آپ کو اوپر بتایا کہ یہ negative 92.46 kilo joule per more ہے which of the following change would affect both the value of constant kp and the proportion of ammonia present in the equilibrium اب یہ چیز یاد رکھئے گا کہ kp جو है, that is only affected by temperature. None of the factor affect Kp or Kc, only temperature, it affects the value of Kp. So, in this case, we have only temperature of Kp or Kc ki value of Kc. Oxidation of SO2 by O2 to SO3 is an exothermic reaction. Upar, our question is negative 196 kJ per mole is enthalpy. Hoti hai. The yield of SO3 will be maximum if. So, this is expression. Hai. Temperature and pressure are increased. Temperature will not increase. Yield will not increase. So, the temperature must be decreased. Uh, both pressure and temperature will not increase. Because when uh, moles of product come, then you will not increase pressure. Badhana padega. So, correct answer is Charlie over here. Temperature is decreased and pressure is increased. When pressure is decreased, so, the reaction will go to that side, which side will 
moles come honge so the correct answer is charlie during contact process of h2so4 synthesis the following occurs which is used to increase the yield of ammonia abhi sorry yield of so3 ye upar wala hi question humne ka temperature decrease hoga aur pressure ko badhayenge so temperature is decrease aur uh, acha ye alag option hai temperature is raised no ye raise nahi karenge so3 form is not removed ये अभी ऊपर इस तरह का क्वेश्चन गुजर चुका है सो डेल्टा इज द करेक्ट आंसर मैन्युफैक्चर ऑफ अमोनिया बाय एनहेबर प्रोसेस इज एन एक्सोथर्मिक प्रोसेस नेगेटिव 92.46 किलो जूल एनर्जी इसमें से जो है वो रिलीज होती है इन ऑर्डर टू गेट मैक्सिमम यील्ड ऑफ SO3 ऑल ऑफ द फॉलोइंग आर ऑप्टिमम कंडीशंस एक्सेप्ट SO3 की जो फॉर्मेशन है ये एन एक्सोथर्मिक प्रोसेस है नेगेटिव 196 है तो टेंपरेचर बढ़ाने से जो है ना वो यील्ड कम हो जाएगी Which of the following statement are correct about the Haber's process for the manufacture of ammonia? At higher temperature, yield goes down, but rate of uh, ammonia formation it is faster. Because exothermic reaction at temperature बढ़ाने से yield इसकी कम होगी. The oxidation of SO2 to SO3 is an exothermic. Which of the following will uh, give us maximum yield? Temperature is reduced and pressure is increased. Upper question is तरह का ये repeated है. अगले topic में हम मिलते हैं. Assalamualaikum.